Hey, g'day all, it's Temujin from SL Colonies. I just wanted to give you all a quick update on our HUD. Actually, we've got a new update to the meter HUD that you guys might actually find pretty exciting. First one is a campfire, which will, you can click on your tool menu and hit campfire. And it will raise out a, uh, a basic campfire and chair system. Um, yep, and these are temp res. So you can sit on this. We will add uh, new updates to models, of course. But you can sit on a chair and your energy will regenerate um, every five minutes, every time the server ticks. You can also use this campfire as, a, as your own personal cooking station. You'll have access to all the um, basic recipes. Um, we will be adding, for example, fish. Um, you can cook a fish that you've just uh, gone and caught on sim and uh, cook it. You can leave it here because it is temp res. Now, the other awesome system that uh, our script has just finished is a, a compass. So have a look at this. Use tool, compass, attached. So this little thing here, instead of going around and physically gathering items, we can add little things like twigs, twine, even an Easter egg hunt. You select here with your book what type of item you're going to look for. I'm going to look for some fauna. So this would be little lizards and things. Then you hit the search icon. And you'll do a little searching thing. And you see this has gone red. It's telling me roughly where this item's located. If I was more, I believe it's more than 25 meters, it would have um, told me there's nothing in the area. So let's go, which way is this? Let's go have a look. Telling me it's north. So we'll head north around the sim. And we'll see if we can find this item. You can check every 10 seconds if you're closer. It's like Marco Polo, I suppose. You're warm or cold. Yeah, it's another search. It's saying it's still that way in the reds. See that? So I'm going to go look this way. It does use five energy every time you search. So let's try about here. Another three seconds I need to wait. Now I'm in the yellow, so I'm getting closer. I'm going to target my compass this way. And try, I'm probably going to be too quick, another five seconds. Oh, and there's a the greens over there now, so I'm very close. It's probably going to be around here. And I should have my item, but I just need to wait for the ticker. And what am I going to find here? I found a snake. <laughs> Picked that up pretty safely. And once you've done that, you can select another item you want to find, so mineral. Now, this bar here is how long you've got to find the mineral. I believe it's 10 minutes. So if you don't find it within 10 minutes, you'll be able to select another item to find. So now that I've selected mineral, if I go to click another item I want to look for, it won't let me. I'm already searching for minerals. So here we are, we're looking and it has found something on sim, a little snake. Well, sorry, this is mineral, so I don't even know what I'm going to find. Now, each of these items you go find are on loot tables, so you've got a chance of finding various different things on that table. It's pretty exciting. I'll find one more thing and I'll end the video. Let's go, so yellow over here now. Click about here. Another five seconds. And yep, so I'm in the right direction. It's probably about five meters. We'll go to about here. And we'll wait for the timer. Another seven seconds. Click now. And I found a clock, a rock. There we go. So let us know what you think. Thanks all.